Hello again everyone. In this video tutorial we are going to use synthetic division to divide these two given polynomials. In this step we want to make sure that our leading coefficient in divisor must be 1. As you can see this is 2. How we can make it 1? By just dividing this one by 2. If you divide this one by 2 you must divide this one by 2 as well. This simply become what? x minus 1 over 2. And also just keep in your mind we're not going to divide these numbers and the dividend by 2 at this point. We're going to take care of them later on. So now our problem is going to look like this form. Okay? Just keep in your mind. And now we're going to perform our synthetic division. So the very first thing as you can see that I put down already the coefficients in the dividend right up here 14, negative 5, negative 11, negative 11 and 8. Now I want you to focus on the divisor and look at this number which is what? Negative 1 over 2. The opposite sign of negative 1 over 2 is positive 1 over 2. So this positive 1 over 2 is going to go right up here. So now we're going to get started. So I want you to put down 14 as it is. It comes down over here right up here. Now I want you to multiply 1 over 2 times 14 and that's going to give you 7. Multiply 7. 7 and negative 5. You add them up so that's going to give you 2. Now multiply this 1 over 2 times 2. That's going to give you 1. Negative 11 and 1 makes negative 10. Once again multiply 1 over 2 times negative 10 is going to give you negative 5. Negative 5 and negative 11 it's going to give you negative 16 and finally once again multiply 1 over 2 times negative 16 and that's going to give you negative 8. 8 and negative 8 is going to give you 0 as remainder. So now what we got right now this 14 so this is going to be with x power 3 this is going to be x power 2 this is going to be x and this is without x which is called constant. So we can write this whole thing as 14 x power 3 plus 2 x square minus 10 x minus 16. So once we put it down this thing so now at this point we're going to be dividing by 2 as we did the divisor in the previous step by 2. So we're going to divide across the board by 2 by 2. So what we got? Our complete answer is going to be 7x power 3 plus x square minus 5x minus 8. And that is our answer. Thanks for watching and please subscribe to my channel for more exciting video lessons.